James Donaghy. I'll go with James. Yes, he, he had a chance to put his uh, iPad on and uh, some of the music wasn't great. It was very gangsterish. So. Corey Brown just shades it as the worst, uh, worst music at the club. Ah, I think definitely the young fellas, they are listening a lot of hip hop and I don't like that. <laughs> oh man, pretty much all the young ones. Uh, easily Corey Brown. I don't even understand some of the words that are said in his music, but he puts his iPod on and the rest of us just, just shake our heads, it's terrible. I think you'll find unanimously there'll be one candidate. I hope he's not angry if I say that I definitely look Bratton. Oh, <laughs> that's an easy one. <laughs> ah, easy, Luke Bratton. Worst dressed, quite easy actually, Luke Bratton. Luke Bratton, you might have heard that before, I guess. Yeah, he always wears terrible gear on a daily basis. Um, you can't call his style a style, I guess. <laughs> Saying that, he's just got rid of his beard, so he's taken one step in the right direction. With his tie-dyed hats, tie-dyed shirts, camouflage gear is uh, horrendous. Oi, now I have to think. Um... Matty Smith, he's just too intelligent a guy. Whenever he tries to be really funny, it, it doesn't really work, you know? <laughs> Me and Bess I have this thing where, because um, we room together and we're pretty close here at Brisbane, but he's, he's got the worst banter by far. Uh, Matt Smith, our captain. Uh, I love him, he is a, a great friend and a great person, but his jokes are just not good. <laughs> uh, I don't think anyone wants this honour to be honest, so I might take one for the team here and say Shane Stefanuto is the worst trainer at the club. I, I, I don't have it there, or maybe in Europe I can tell you some, for sure, so, a lot of them, but not really in the row. Well, that's, that's a tough one, because we're actually super professional at the row, so I can't think of anyone that doesn't give 100% of training? Can't answer that question.